Hey guys, so today I want to show you guys how to make awesome flyers for cheap. Um, if you have Photoshop, this is kind of all you need, and this is going to be for minimal price. I'll show you how this works out. So, all these flyers you see online that are for uh, events, concerts, or whatever, they all look pretty good, and it all looks like, man, I could never do that, but these are so easy to do. Most of these are done with templates. This is like a before and after. This is a before, how you buy the template. This is what you turn it into to customize it for yourself. So uh, all these all these templates are uh, PSD files. They're all editable in Photoshop, and uh, you can buy them online for uh, minimal price. Here's how this works. So the site that I use, there's a lot of stock sites out there. The one that I use is Envato, and this particular one is called Graphic River. Envato is a stock information site. They they sell everything from WordPress themes to code, video, uh, stock video, stock audio. This is stock graphics. So if you go to print and flyers and you can type in kind of whatever you want as far as uh, the, the the type of flyer you're looking for. Um, I mean if it's they've got everything in the world. They've got thousands of these. So it's anything from uh, uh, New Year's Eve to a uh, you know a concert flyer or a menu or a pool party, anything you want to do that's, uh, that has to do with, with uh, your event. So say I want to, I want to uh, do a pool party flyer, type in your keyword, here's all of your uh, examples. So this is what they look like and this is what the before looks like or this is kind of what the general vibe of that flyer is. So once, when you, like this is seven dollars. Most of these are you know, look at the pricing over here. They're about seven to twenty bucks in most cases. And like I say, they've got everything. When you buy one of these things and download them, it ends up being a PSD file. So what that looks like is if you go to, um, so it looks like this. You open a PSD file, it's going to look like a flyer like the one you just bought for seven, eight bucks, right? All these are your layers. So all you do is you can delete these layers as you see fit, and these are all. This is all. All goes by you know stackable information on Photoshop. So the way you make it your own, and so th this is a JPEG right here. But this one, same thing. It had a bunch of layers, and um, or is it? Let me see. Oh yeah, this is the this is the PSD as well. So as you can see, you can change it however you want to. So if we go back to this one then all it takes is to pull your information that you want uh, let's see here say we want to go with my pretty face pull this uh, pull your, your photo up drag it over and put it to where you want it get rid of the background stuff and then all of these all this text is all editable so I can, I mean this text is obviously pretty ugly, but I can change all this stuff however I want it to. So everything on here is editable. All this text is editable. I may not have the fonts, but if you don't have the fonts, who cares? So you change the wording of all this stuff, Oops. and there you go. You put your logo in here. You change the, you could change the background if you want to. I mean, every one of these elements. You can get rid of it, you can add stuff to it, whatever you want to do. So when the time you're all done, you basically turn this into your information. And then when you're done with that, you export it as a JPEG and post it. So that's it. This whole thing costs after, I mean, Photoshop will cost you about 20 bucks a month. And it's, I don't think they have any contracts. I think you just buy it and use it as long as you have to. Like I said, these are about seven or eight dollars. Uh, sure does beat gra a graphic designer spending, you know, a hundred, a hundred and a quarter per flyer. At one job I had, I was making 73 flyers a week. So that is an unbelievable amount of volume. So at that, there's no way I could have built these from scratch. All these are templates. And don't think of template as something cheesy because the first thing that comes to my mind, or that used to, is that a template is going to look hokey because everybody else uses the same thing but these days templates look really awesome they're designed by top-notch graphic designers and they're that's what they're there for for you to swap out your information into 
and post it. All right, I hope this helps.